if you're going to use trichlor in your vinyl pool or fiberglass pool, you definitely want to make sure you have plenty of soda ash on hand. As you can see that this pool's uh, pH has dropped below 7.2. So I'm going to add some soda ash to bring it up. When the pH gets this low, you'll have burning eyes, itchy skin, and it will eventually damage the equipment as the, it gets corrosive. You also know the size of your pool when you're going to raise the pH up with the soda ash. It also raises the alkalinity, so I'll have the chart with the pool size and the amount to add. I like adding it directly to the skimmer because that way it's really powdery if you add it directly into the pool. And since it uh, has a high pH, it won't damage the equipment as it goes through. And you'll see some blowback as it goes back through your system, but it won't be as bad as if you broadcast it directly in your pool. And check your pool three hours later, and you should see it had raised the pH up uh, from the dangerous level to the good level, and even a high level, pretty rapidly. And you got to be careful not to put too much pH up, soda ash in. It'll raise the alkalinity level up also. And dropping alkalinity is very difficult.